Hello everybody, welcome back to the aisle. I uh, went to a French server which I hadn't thought I'd been on before, but apparently I was, uh, as I'm here as Gallimimus. So we're gonna wander around as a Gallimimus, of course. And should I do uh, not get eaten? It doesn't look like this was the one with the... Or could it have been? One where there was a... Uh... What was that called? There was one that was wounded and then there was a very small creature next to us as well. I've forgotten all of the names. All the names are gone. Wait, maybe it was that server. Not sure. Well, either way, we are here with Galimimus. No, it was the one with the uh, suicidal Gretosaurus who wanted the Shunto to kill him. That's what the one was. Okay, great. I know where we are. Um, doesn't mean I know where the water is, but I am going to go look for it and some activity, of course. So I'll be right back as soon as something interesting pops up. Once again, more floating rocks for some reason. I'm not quite sure why this is here. It doesn't even connect to the ground. Yeah, I'm guessing the yoga masters of old that lived in this day and age. I don't know what... Um, this is supposed to be a high quality test map, so... Get on that aisle, people, if you're watching. Probably not, but who knows? If you are, fix this rock. This one right here. I'll give you the coordinates. Hang on. It's uh, 54 and minus 115 and about minus 9 in height. I'm guessing that's the height. There. Fix it. I think we're getting uh, to be near some water. It's I think it's down that way, but I'll take a quick look around this corner here. Should be... Yep, yeah, it's in the distance. Okay, that means it's probably going to be busy here. It's going to... Do a little overview of the area, see if we see anybody moving. If you see somebody, let me know, because I don't see them yet. There's definitely water. Looking for anything that has a color that does not match the surroundings. So far, I don't see any, and I don't see anything behind me either. Of, uh, well, there's that rock over there, but uh, not of the rock I was just talking about. Different rock. I don't know if there's going to be people here. Just going to quickly go downhill, hopefully not break anything, because that would mean I'd be delivering uh, the food right to their doorstep if there are people here. Uh, still nothing. I'm going to go towards the uh, hill over here, because I noticed that there's nothing on the hill. That's always good. I'll try to get to the water from this angle. Oops. A little tree issues there. No, nothing here yet either. Can I just go and get a drink? Is that really a thing now? Lots of bushes. Let's see now. Uh, I'm tempted to lie down, but if I lie down I'll make a weird noise and that would alert somebody who is currently AFK or sleeping. So we're not going to do that. Nope, I think we can actually approach this water. I'm going to go for the corner bit here next to the tree. Trees have served as well in the past, so they'll probably continue to do so in the future because I don't think they have any other interesting things going on. Yep. Just gonna fill up my bar. Or drop, I guess, water droplets. Nothing so far? Nothing on the other side? That is amazing. Or people just don't tend to go here because there's a much better pool somewhere else. Well, either way, I like this pool because it is very available. There are usually some people. Just not today, I suppose. Right, I'm gonna go this way then. I'll have my drink. Have some food. Can I have the food? No? Okay, great. I'll not have food. I'll have food later. And I'm a happy camper. I'm gonna go this way. I see a rune in the distance there. Right in the middle, do you see it? We should uh, check it out. There's usually some activity there. Oh, and these are also the same runes that we were at last time when the, uh, we had just discovered the herd and then we suddenly timed out. This is the same place. Yep, with the thing over there, right? Nobody here currently. There were people up on the hill over there. Look at him looking. Is there anybody up there? Hello? Uh, not here now, though. Gigantic rock in the middle. May have been a meteorite. I don't know. Um, nothing here to see. That's unfortunate. I'll just go walk around a bit and hopefully we'll see some herbivores rather than carnivores. Uh, we are very unlike uh, the actual dinosaurs, I'm guessing, that we tend to gather in places like this because humans like to gather at special locations, whereas natural creatures just go wherever the food is. I had to pause there for a second because there was a very noisy thing in the background. 
which I didn't want to record because this isn't his video at all. It's mine. All right, so um, let's see. Uh, as I was saying, people tend to gather in places that have a special structure or some type of like that thing over there, a gigantic rock. It has some type of magnetic pull on people. But uh, the actual creatures just go where the food is. They wouldn't be interested in these rocks at all because you can't eat it, and neither can you eat this. Uh, we're really weird creatures, I suppose. But we are intelligent, and we have actually uh, ended up creating the game in which we pretend to be creatures who don't understand these things, which is fun. Um, so, yay for us. Either way, there's no activity here now. How many people are on the server? There were quite a few early, but maybe some people logged off? Okay, so it's reasonable, but not too many. It's like a 20-something. Uh, well, we should be able to see somebody then. Someone should be here. Uh, not here in particular, apparently, but somewhere. I think I'll go... Uh, let's pick a direction. Oh god. I'm hearing something. I don't know where it is. Where is it? Where is it? I hear him. What, where is he? He's probably sneaking, but I don't see him, so I don't know. He can't be sneaking here. At least not too close to me, because... I would have seen him by now. Panning around. That sounds... Hey! That's not a herbivore sound, but that is a herbivore over there. Hey, how you doing? Uh, hello? Oh, careful. You'll break something. Is he chasing you? I guess. Oh yeah, there he is. Hello. Uh, let's not go towards where that guy is then, because he's probably going to go after the bigger meal and not me. He's going to go a little bit closer to this hill over here, so I can keep a good eye on both of them and see what they do. I'm going to get on this little thing. Oh, no. I can't. Right, so where are you? You're over there, and he is over there. Uh, I'm gonna go lie down over here. I'm gonna wait. Why are you calling? Do you want him to come over and finish you? Apparently they do, I don't know. I'm just a little brown head sticking out of the grass. Meanwhile, that guy is apparently ignoring both of us. Because you can certainly hear the Shantasaurus. I don't know what the heck is doing going over there. Oh, oh, where are you going? Whoa! Oh. He killed himself by falling off the hill. Well, that was uh, weird and pretty stupid. And uh, he hasn't noticed. He's not coming back for it. Let's go and take a look. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Is he coming back? Let's go and mourn our temporary friend. Oh no, you're dead now. Your head is moving, I don't know why that is. Apparently that have Ooh, he's jittering all over the place. I did hear some really heavy footsteps, but I don't know where they are. Well, he went that way. Apparently didn't notice that his friend over here is dead, or whoever this was to him, I don't know. He didn't want to kill him, apparently. He doesn't appear to be bleeding. So I don't think that he was attacked. I guess he had originally broken his leg anyway, and now he wanted somebody to end it. And he ended up ending it himself by falling down the hill. Committed suicide. Oh no, such a sad thing. Right, okay, well that's you. You can just keep nodding, I suppose, and zoom in a little bit. There you go. Nod away. Once again, at the pause for some background noise. Look at him jerking around like that. The front leg keeps to move. It keeps moving every once in a while. And I'm moving a lot as well. The camera keeps uh, bobbing up and down based on what my head is doing. Right, so far the other guy hasn't shown up, so I guess he just didn't see and doesn't care. Or he just wasn't hungry. Don't know why though. Never mind, I'm gonna go and uh, not go that way because that's where that guy went. 
I feel this fantastic activity. I think we should just go ahead deeper into the forest. Hopefully we'll see some people there. Who are friendly. Let's try to eat things as well. I haven't eaten in a while. No, not this. What do I eat again? I don't know. Uh, not these. I've tried them already. Uh, no, no. Nothing of interest here. Well, I'll just keep going until I see something else. Look at the top of those two hills over there. There's like spikes or something. They look really strange from this angle. Can we get up there and see what it is? Let's try going up the hill a little bit and not break our legs or commit suicide like the uh, Shantunga from earlier. Come on, get up here. I can't jump. Oh, I can jump. I just can't go anywhere. That's all. Ooh. Try not to, uh, oops, hurt yourself too much. There we go. We are on the crest here. Let's try going up, up on the hill. Up, up and away. Whoopsie. Uh, no, a little bit more, a little bit more. The pixels are in the way. Yes. Okay, well, I can't get over this bit. Well, there's just weird rocks over here, okay? Uh, now we have a really nice view with a nice fog coming up out the land. Nothing's happened over here so far. It's really quiet. Let's see if I can turn without uh, dying. Okay, so apparently these Gallimimus are a little bit easier to go downhill with. And I wouldn't just just them jumping down here, but still uh, the type of hills that would normally break my legs if I were a slightly larger dinosaur uh, doesn't seem to bother these too much, I say, so I carefully try to get down the hill without breaking a leg. Anyway, and I succeeded. Okay, good. Right, as I was saying, it's easier to go downhill with one of these. And since they can jump, it's also easier to go up a hill. Now let's take a look from this angle and see if that makes any difference. Nope, they're just really weird spiky rocks. Like if you had a gigantic roll of cling film or something, you would just stretch it out of one end and then pull it down sharply over these rocks and then you'd just have a clear piece to do something with. Wrap up some uh, Bredosaurus burgers. I don't know what you were going to do with cling film in the Jurassic era, but perhaps you have some use for it. I don't know. Either way, let's take a look at what's at the end of this little gorge thing. I'm hearing noises and I don't like them. I don't know where they're coming from. Perhaps I'm running right towards my end, actually. Let's lie down. Nope. Oh yeah, that's right, I can uh, pretend to be hurt. I'm gonna lie down. Because I think it's from over there. I see something light over there. What is this, a cave? What is down here? Oh, there's water. Hello. No wonder there's activity. Where right, there's water, there's life. And when there's life, there's probably beer somewhere. Also, I'm resting. I'm gonna wait and see what he does. Or what anybody does. I'll be back in a bit. I see someone in the background, and I think he spotted me as well. Let's get out of here. I think it would be a good idea to go down this here, over here. La 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 la, like that. And try jumping. Oh, okay, so they can actually break. Didn't mean to do that. Oh, uh... Is this a good idea? No, it's not. But I am lying down, and he was down the gorge. Uh, I want to go somewhere where I can hide and look around, which sounds like a great combination. Uh, get up. And try to move a little bit further down. There. Lie down over here. There. If he comes up over here now, and tries to catch us, we should present a bit of a problem, because he'll fall down the thing, and he'll break his legs as well. I'm gonna wait and see what happens. He hasn't come over yet. I occasionally think I hear a footstep, but I'm not sure where it's coming from. That might be a dead dinosaur, but it may also just be wood. It tends to be wood whenever I think a dinosaur is lying dead somewhere. I might try to call him, see if he'll come over anyway. I'm down here. You have to make a bit of a jump in order to get here, but you could totally come and eat me, I suppose, if you wanted. And if not, then not, I suppose. This is a nice little view, though, if you wanted to keep an eye on all the activity around the water, although sadly now there is none. If there was, though, perhaps this would be a great spot. Now, he seems to have decided that I am too small of a meal to come chase me. That's unfortunate. 
Also, I'm wondering if what I saw over there was even a dinosaur. This probably is also some type of wood. I keep getting uh, confused with wood. No. I don't hear him. Either way, so I'm hiding down here in the bushes. And probably next time I log on to the server, he'll be here still. Possibly. Can't even eat this, can I? Nope. Can't eat any of this. I'm gonna kill here, I guess, because I can't really do much else. I could jump further down into the water. That'll probably kill me. Uh, we could try that. And this spectacularly, if we could find the edge. What's down here? I can't jump anymore, so let's just hope we hit the water. That's water down there, isn't it? Okay, Banzai! Whee! Oh, I'm in the water. And I'm actually able to swim. Amazing. Okay, well that was a bit anticlimactic. Alright, cool. We didn't even hear a splashing sound. They really need to do something with this water. You can't see when something is in it because it doesn't move. And whenever you do end up uh, falling into it, it doesn't make a sound. It's like it's not even there. Right, so this is a bit of a spot for me. I can't go and do anything right now. I'm lie down over here. And I'm going to say thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye for now.